Hi, today I'm going to show you what I'm going to be using for the month of October. So, of course, everyone loves pumpkin, or most people love pumpkin during the fall. So, I'm going with the pumpkin theme this time. I got this soap, it's pumpkin soap, from Etsy. Apricus is the name of, of, of the shop. And um, this is kind of small, so when this gets used up, I'm going to use their honeybee soap afterwards. So these are the two soaps I use, and I'm going to be using. And the shower, I'm using up, it's like halfway done, my Hero Cleanser, which I like well enough. It's a really fun cleanser, it looks almost like pineapple jello. So you can see that um, I like it. Trying to finish that up. And for hair, I'm still using, you've seen, seen it in, in the other videos, um, the solid shampoo I got from Wegmans, High Bar. That's still going strong. And after I soap up, I'm using this body scrub I got from Twinkles Boutique. So um, I'm using, um, well, it comes with a little spoon too, it's really cool this scrub so what does it smell like it does smell pretty good it's kind of spicy well, spicy in the sense that it's kind of like um a nutmeg slash clove sort of scent but yeah pumpkin spice so after that i'll be lotioning with this and i think you can see from the packaging that this was um an older version um, from an, from an, an, an older release from Bath and Body Works of their pumpkin pecan waffle lotion. To be honest, I kind of like this older design. Wish I hadn't changed it. I guess I kind of have to because um, they like to get to give their products a makeover now and then. This is very cute and charming. And I'm also using vanilla body spray, also an older packaging very pretty. Uh, this is about, I don't know if you can see, but like halfway done. So I'm going to keep using it up. I'm also using this deodorant from Native. Surprisingly, it doesn't really smell um, like vanilla as I thought it would. It does, but um, there are also hints of marshmallow and a sweeter scent to it, which is pretty cool because a lot of these companies, they kind of just give you any sweet scent, you know, you can't really tell the difference. But um, anyway, liking Native a lot. I'm continuing with the whole sweet theme, um, using Toast the Marshmallow and Vanilla. So that's for the deodorant. And afterwards, um, I'm trying to get through the lactic acid. To be honest with you, since I haven't really been leaving the house that much, I haven't really been using um, too many skincare products, except for maybe eye cream, lip balm, and some other things. But I am still trying to continue on um, to take care of my skin as I get older, and um, trying to you know protect my skin. So I've been using this up. I'll keep using it. And for eye cream, I'm almost done. Um, happy to report that I'm almost done with my guava eye cream from Glow Recipe that I showed you all a few videos ago. Um, so I'm trying to finish up this one. And you can see that I've used a lot of it. That's how much is left. It's really thick and heavy and it feels so good going on. And when that is done, I'm going to be dipping into this eye cream, which is also emollient and a little bit bouncy. don't love the smell, but so far I noticed that my eye area looks a lot better. And I'm also using this 
pie bomb, which is um really convenient. You want to put it in your purse or something if you're traveling. It's very, very moisturizing. So, it's using it up, and um, so far I'm liking what I'm using. Oh, so um, during the daytime, um, whenever I'm home, not, I'm not wearing any makeup. I try to use something else on my face. I've been using this. So far, I like it. So, um, this was also featured in a different video earlier. Um, that's what it looks like. So, I do like this, but, um, I found out that Tula is now owned by Procter & Gamble, so I'm going to stop buying from them. I was hoping to support a, 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 um, a South Asian-owned business, but, um, that's, this is not, not, this is not, not this is, it, it, this is not them anymore. So, um... This is probably going to be the last of um, what, I, what I buy from them. As for hand cream, I was using this. And it has made my skin kind of drier. Um, this is just really weird. This is the only thing I've been using that um, could possibly be, be the problem. So, um, this didn't work for me. I'm using this instead. Let's see what happens. This is from Korea. And I am still kind of working through my Nisa lip balm. That's how much is left. So I'm really happy that um, I'm consistent with this and I'm using it up. Um, it's a great lip balm. We'll always be charmed by the little cartoon avocado. Um, so yeah, I think that's pretty much it for what I'm going to be using for this month. Let me know in the comments what you plan on using in the shower and on your face for this month.